Today is the 16th of December um, and today our reading is from Luke chapter 2 verses 1 to 5 called The Journey. History is full of incredible journeys, whether it is Scott's quest for the South Pole, Lewis and Clark heading west across North America or Napoleon transversing the Alps. There are no shortage of all inspiring journeys for us to read about and perhaps dream of one day doing ourselves. Yet for all these journeys undertook, for all they cost, for all they saw and delivered, none could hold a candle to that described in Luke chapter 2 verses 1 to 5. Some months have passed since Mary received the news she would give birth to a son called Jesus. Everything is beginning to come together in preparation for this history altering moment. At this point in the Christmas story, have you ever paused to think how amazing it is that God ordained long beforehand that Jesus would be born in Bethlehem as Micah chapter five, verse two to five shows. Even more amazing is the fact that God would put it into the heart of Caesar Augustus to call for a census, leading Mary and Joseph naturally to Joseph's ancestral in Bethlehem. For any other characters, book or story, we might cry, coincidence, but this is not just any other book and story. There is more at play within these verses than we dare to ever realize, and it is not because of Augustus. Throughout scripture, God weaves his grand story together, guiding the different forces, political, economical, industrial, at work in the world for the sake of his kingdom and his servants. God is able to write the story to bring Mary and Joseph from Nazareth to Bethlehem in time to see the Micah prophecy fulfilled. He is truly the sovereign one, a great big God, involved then and also now in the lives of his children. Truly he is the light and hope of all the world, our eternally reigning saviour. Let us pray. Father, thank you for how you have woven your grand story into my life's journey by your grace. Continue to guide me, I pray. Amen. Our challenge for today is to take some time to reflect on where and how God has shaped your journey.